I have gone out of my way and purchased every available item at Taco Bell. Yep. The total price, guess, is 40 items. Like 100 bucks? Yeah. A little, a little north. It was like 112, north 120, of something like that. Yeah. We're going to try them all. I think by the end, we got to pick our three to pick and our three to avoid. Okay. From Taco Bell. All right. Okay. Now I've I've done it in sections. So we have the burrito section, we have the taco section, we have the quesadilla section, and then we have the ooh, Taco Bell's getting a little cute today They're section. They're getting a little custom. They're getting a little freak what, what is a frittata? Well, that's just like a normal thing. It's they made it's it up. It's not some exotic like They have this thing called nachos. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I have no clue. Our first item is the Doritos Locos Do get... Tacos. Yeah. No, we each eat one bite. Oh. It oh, is... like Lassie? Yeah, it is. Lassie and the boy dog? It is kind of like... Um, oh, God, Gone dude. from what was Dorito to like... Uh... This is what happens in 30 minutes. Yeah. This is like... Uh, I don't know how to describe this. Touch it. And... Yeah, okay. So it does feel right. very weird. Let it's me, like let spongy. Me, let me get in there. It's like... <laughs> I gotta say, the Dorito actually changes it a bit. I would disagree. Really? Nothing happening here is new to me. It's the same old piece of shit taco that reminds me of being broke in college, broken up with, drunk, just in bad spots emotionally and okay, physically. Okay, so this is more like, how about you just review how it tastes, you know? Cause like most people- Well, don't... isn't taste really just a journey of like our lives, man? Watch. No, 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 sweet boy, sweet bear, I'm not do gonna, not do I'm this, not gonna, not gonna, because you'll get too full, so don't, I can't, I can't stop you, you're just gonna get really full and gross, and you're gonna be like, oh, I can't eat this, like, last thing. God damn it! <laughs> Fuck, it's a disaster. This is normal this mode. This is just a hard shell taco. Yeah. This is, like, stock, bone stock, no mods, uh, you know, just you and your jewel. Okay, so here's the question. Is the hard shell taco better or worse than the Doritos Locos taco? It's better, but only slightly, right? What the, the Doritos Loco, Loco. Wrong. Doritos Wrong. Locos tacos Wrong. In, introduced was just more salt. Yes. You know, and more you know nacho what's good? grossness. A little salt in my diet. Yeah, no. Just think about it as its individual thing. I am. I, well, you it has you more... literally asked me to compare it against the thing we just ate, you fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> it's not just its individual thing. I want it's you compared to say against the last thing. something so that I am right. What do you want? I, I, yeah, man. <laughs> Thanks. Eh. Put her there. Brother. <laughs> Is this a cheese or with, crunch? With Doritos or Fritos inside? I, I should have labeled this. This is such a fucking mess, man. No, it's great. All right, what do we think of our product? I think it's trying to introduce two textures into the into the dish here. I don't really think it's doing its job. I actually feel overwhelmed by the amount of like outside. Yeah. And I want more inside. I they want to see what's deep down. They focused on texture and they forgot about taste on the way. <laughs> I will say everything. <laughs> so far, double stack's the worst thing I've eaten. Yeah. The Doritos Locos is the best. So the last one was the double stack with nachos or Fritos. This one is just a regular old Do we really stack. need to experience that? We just... <laughs> you have to eat every item, man. Which includes... I'm probably gonna throw up after this. Sauce, a bit smoky, a bit rich. <laughs> it has this oaky afterbirth. Yeah, it's like, a, it's, like a, it's like wood chips that you get at Home Depot. This very nice, tastes, very exotic. It tastes better than the double stack with nachos. So this, this is my childhood favorite item from Taco Bell. The cheesy gordita crunch. This is big. This is huge. A soft shell. Mm -hmm. A hard shell. Cheese. I might spoil myself on this bite. You are a bit. You're a bit excited. He likes it. Mm. Ooh, I've never seen you so satisfied. It's, oh, have a bite, please. Sure, man. Please. It really get in there. Really get a little something. You got any napkin? Uh, no, no napos. <laughs> I found one, don't worry about it. That was my beanie! <laughs> You're not supposed to look. So, okay, look, Cheesy Gordita Crunch, I have to say, For it's my minutes. number one so far. Uh, all right, this is a, uh, it's like a double stack. Oh, I can hear it. That's what good pussy sounds like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gross. <laughs>
It's a double stack with like fucking. <laughs> it's called the, the good dust. pussy taco. <laughs> this is the good pussy taco. Let's give it a bite. <laughs> now from Taco Bell, the good pussy taco. Huh. I'm super white, so it's a little bit of heat. <laughs> I didn't want to say it first. <laughs> yeah. I'm, not do, I'm not doing so great. I was just pretending. I was like, huh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I feel it. I feel yeah. it. Uh, uh, it. You know, if I'm feeling a little crazy one night, I might go I might go and get one of these. I do, I do like it. I got to be in a mood. Ooh, this the does. Chalupa. Okay, this is good. This is good you, like the, uh, you like the Chalupa? I'm a Chalupa fan. Do you want to? We'll have a hot Chalup. Oh, okay. Lady in the... I'm the boy dog. I'm the boy dog. I'm so uncomfortable. That's really uncomfortable. Now, <clears throat> the new introduction here is the Chalupa sort of puffy, cloudy, yeah. vape cloud type of experience. Don't like it. I like it. It, it traps in that delicious Taco Bell grease. That you know is really like the mother's milk of the whole experience. Oh, this is it. <laughs> this is the uh, shredded chicken taco. Yeah, that just tastes like not great. This is the steak. This soft is where it gets taco. really dicey. This is what gets you sick. I had food poisoning after eating at a, a two Michelin star restaurant. Yeah. So if I fall to Taco Bell, that's fair. <laughs> that's fair. Ugh. They've drowned it. They've drowned it in everything that's not steak. It really does have a shitload of like... Like other shit. Yeah. No, 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 you don't want this. This is bad. No, I do. Because we have the spicy potato taco. <gasps> Fuck. This is my favorite item at Taco Bell. I love the way that it is so solid. <laughs> And feels like golf balls in your mouth. <laughs> but also has a little crunch. Explain to me what's going on in your mouth right now. This explosion. The potatoes are so old that it's difficult to chew. <laughs> I think the reason it's the best item is because they like, they grill the potatoes. Or like they fry them or whatever. So they have like they a shell. They fry them, man. They have a shell. They yeah. have crunch. But the thing is, the sauce carries it so hard, almost too much. I just need that to have a crunch. A texture so the sauce can carry. Mm. Sometimes you let the sauce carry. But if if all of Taco Bell is just delivery vehicles for sauce, like what are we really doing, man? What are we doing Dude, to that's, our lives? That's fucking food, man. No, no, man. That's it's food. not. No, it's not. That's fucking it pasta. Shouldn't, it shouldn't be that's that. That's pasta. Way. I don't like that. I don't like that idea. Because that to you, you're saying that the frosting is more important than the cake. And what's outside is more important than what's on inside. And that's fucked up. Yeah, and I don't it's like all that. about looks. Judge a book by its cover. All right, look. We're, we're just different. At the end of the taco section, we were left with a few choices, so we have to make a decision. What okay. was your favorite taco? What was your least favorite taco? My favorite taco was the cheesy gordita crunch. Cheesy gordita crunch was also my favorite taco. It just did everything right. It gave us everything we needed, everything we desired, and then some. Some things we didn't know we wanted, and that's the beauty, right? I will say secret shout-outs to the, I think it's like the Chipotle Ranch Double Stack. Are you talking about the hot one? The hot one. That gave us a little heat yeah. in, the, in the kitchen. I kind of liked it. I kind of liked it, I like how my mouth too. feels right now. Yeah, this is how, this is just white people experiencing <laughs> flavor. <laughs> I'm Mexican now. <laughs> yeah. As far as bad, yeah. shitty. The rest. Shitty butt butt poop. Me it's the, honestly, the poop rest. Poop ass. I think that the, actually the default or the Dorito was my worst experience. Default For me, they show. all just fell into like one taste and it was like the same thing. You know what I mean? This is... A tortilla with cheese. Is this called something? It's called brilliant, <laughs> amazing, innovative. But by Taco Bell, they call it the cheesy roll-up. I think what happened is somebody fucked up a quesadilla. They just and the manager out. made a mogul move and said, you roll it. <laughs> and then they served it. <laughs> and that's how they invented the goddamn cheesy roll-up. It is time to tackle the largest section featuring one, two, three, four, Count what you have. five, 12, 13 items. The burritos are here. This is so many, dude. 
<laughs> Dude. <laughs> oh, wait, I forgot one. 14. Are you sure? <laughs> Ooh, it's, it's this goated? one is the potato burrito. I'm so dry. Yeah, what they did is they ditched the sauce and they so said more cheese. It's like I just put notebook paper in my mouth. <laughs> Everything about it is wrong. I'm so disappointed. F. I was so excited. Fail. All right, this is the uh, this is the bean burrito. Okay. What do we under? Look at that cross section. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the cross. <laughs> Fuck. No, I. I hate it, dude. <laughs> I hate it. I fucking hate it, huh? I hate that. I think it's fine. Yeah, that's because you eat beans out of a can. <laughs> yeah, those are good, though. It's fine. It's just bean and some cheese. It's just bean. It is literally just I actually, bean. I actually, I just appreciate the simplicity, actually. I don't. I'm with it. This is garbage. I don't love it, but I'm not going to fucking... I don't have anything against it. What is this? It's the beefy Frito burrito. God. What happens? It's bad. Is that the Frito? It's bad, dude. Has dissolved into just starch. <laughs> yeah, it became like a soggy paste. Yeah. Of like Frito paste. And you just like get hit by strands of old Frito. Probably one of the worst things I've ever eaten. It's not very good. God. Uh, this just says sup. No, look at this. This is. Well, look. Do it. We don't need to eat this one. This is the soft. <laughs> How do you zoom in? Sup. Super also, weird. how is that happening? You like that? How did you do that? Don't worry about it. That's crazy. It's voice activated. Zoom in. <laughs> <laughs> zoom out. Is it remote? Is it Luda? It's Luda. That's crazy. No, this is the Soft Taco Supreme. So it's just the Soft Taco, but it has like sour cream in it. I don't think we need to eat this. I think we can save ourselves. Are you ourselves. a pussy? That's what I thought. Unwrap that shit. <laughs> so upset. Yeah, that's sour cream. That is it. There's, it's just the same thing I ate, but now there's sour cream. Makes it better. A little bit. Maybe. All right, now we've hit a very special territory. We've hit items made for vegans. This is the five layer burrito well it's definitely cheese in there so it's not vegan it's vegetarian right vegans are wrong well okay it's not like a correct or incorrect the five layer burrito has meat so it's mostly vegetarian then four of the layers are vegetarian okay this is 80 percent vegetarian sure so it's a vegetarian meal yes 100 <laughs> percent. if it's more than half vegetarian you get that that bean flavor it's very overwhelming, actually. It's just paste. Here's how I view it. Everything inside of a burrito is like what people stereotypically think meals at prisons are like. It's just slop. It is. <laughs> it's slop, but it's encased in like this diaper yeah. of a tortilla. You just have this diapy tortilla, and you just like kind of like nom your teeth through it, and then it just always slop. And slightly different, t like just varying levels of salt in your slop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And maybe that's what they don't give you in prison. Maybe in prison your food isn't really salted, and that's because you're a criminal. And that's how that's how society works. Oh my god. Oh, it's like glue. It's not good. Uh, the rice in here gives it like a more kind of maggoty texture. Let me oh, check. Oh, this burrito supreme. Yeah, it's the burrito supreme. This is great. Well, it's, it's vegetarian. Oh, it's got uh, we got guac. We this is guac. our first encounter of guac. Taco Bell guacamole. Which is probably closer to like, like a melted plastic spoon. That's green. The guac isn't good, but it does add something more. Oh, you! Ooh, he hates it. Oh, I hate that. Burritos have been failing me right so far. I'm not happy with the burrito section. All right, this is shredded chicken burrito. It tastes very tinny. It's like someone turned the treble way up. On the fucking car stereo of my mouth. Ugh. What is happening in here? This looks like a like a Star Wars planet. I feel like I've accumulated like layers of grease on my tongue. So bad, dude. It's so bad. Anytime chip products have been incorporated into the the food, like fuck off. I can't do it. I'm scared for the cracker cross. open, dude. Beep, 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 beep. Ooh, stat track. Oh. oh. I think it's just a beef burrito supreme. 
Buddha, get this cross section. Get this cross section. <laughs> it looks like a, it looks like again a Star Wars creature, but his mouth now. The burrito supreme does is it incorporates lettuce, which isn't really present in a lot of the other burritos, and the tomatoes, and it balances it out. But at the end of the day, you're still eating like you know the diaper tube. Uh, of things, but I find it the most tolerable, and I actually look forward to it when I'm in the mood for TB. <laughs> what? I am begging you, please stop using the word diaper when talking about <laughs> food. <laughs> I'm sorry. All right, here it is. All right, here's the juice of the burrito section, the quesarito, where they have decided to combine a quesadilla and a burrito, making this diaper a little spicier. <laughs> <laughs> he said it. Ludwig Honor seems to like it. That's not bad. If you go vegetarian, not for health reasons, but because you love animals or some shit, and you want to feel like a piece of shit, <laughs> this yeah. will get the job done. If you're an ethical vegetarian who's still a degenerate. Yeah. All right, and we have the final meal, which is the quesarito. Again, it's literally just rice. Wait, no, dude. I think it's the loaded. There's Ugh. meat. <laughs> I'm Ludwig. I'm dropping <laughs> the burrito again. Luda, help me. What's up, boys? Today, the plan is simple. It's to get out of this burrito that an evil wizard has trapped me in. Short. <laughs> short. <laughs> fucking short. I can't. I just. Sniper, can't. get down. <laughs> Sure. You guys are mean to me. Mom, shut up. <laughs> Fifth grade can wait. Mom, I'm 12. Short. <laughs> we're calling them 12 and we're playing with the <laughs> burrito. Playing with burritos. <laughs> for like five minutes. <laughs> to me, it's like a torture device because what happens is you chew it and then like your saliva breaks down the rice and then the cheese and it becomes this like glue and he's like, <laughs> you can't breathe for a second. <laughs> Slime. What was the best item in the burrito section and what was the worst? They're all swirling around right now in my innards. Like yeah. like, a, like 40 different eels that are different species. Yeah. And they're all fighting for the ownership of my stomach. I have to say everything that wasn't the quesarito, the second to last one, sucked. I actually only recommend the quesarito and not even the beef quesarito. The quesarito with bean and rice. Worst? It was probably the one we just ate. What the fuck was it? Uh, the beef quesarito. Though the other ones tasted bad, the last one was, like, gross to me. Yeah, I like, hated the, chewing it. There's a difference between, like, oh, this doesn't taste very good, and I want this out of my I mouth. I don't like thinking about it. I don't like thinking about it. You're right. Yeah. You're right. We have moved on. This is a, a kind of a combo section. It's the quesadilla section, but I put the Crunchwrap Supremes in here. What? I think this is just a shredded chicken... Griller. Why is it so? No, look at this, Ludwig. It's like a wallet. It's it's actually thinner than my wallet. I have this Chick Fil A uh, card. What are you? <laughs> Stop. It's working. Stop. It's working. It's not working. Uh, it's working. <laughs> All right. And so there you go. <laughs> it's got my wallet. <laughs> what did that prove? It proved that this shouldn't be what a food shape is. You could fit that into an actual burrito, though. You could have just been like, look, this is my wallet. This is this. And look at, like, at the difference of thickness. But instead, you just shoved a card into a burrito like a psychopath. All right, so shredded chicken loaded griller, I think. Or shredded chicken griller. It's okay. I think this is my favorite. And you can taste the toasted cheddar. And they also put a little bit of the, of the I think, the Chipotle ranch sauce. All right, like all this. All right Chris Morocco. Just <laughs> <laughs> all I'm saying is I think they put a bit of it, right? It's what, seasoned for well, sure. We thought it was spicy before. They put that in, but smaller amount. And it's basically just enough that if you're white out there, it's got a little kick. Guys, let's hit the Taco Bell. <laughs> I'm in the mood for a little kick in my food. <laughs> Oh, the lacrosse game is today. All right, this is the steak quesadilla. Did we go through the drive-thru and go inside? Uh, Ludwig ordered it on an app because he was embarrassed like a child, like a little baby baby man. Here it is. Stop talking. It's really salty. The meat's really salty. Unfortunately, it's the best so far, even though it's like kind of fucked up. 
Oh, there's so much weight. We got crunch wraps. We got stop, some pre- Stop, They're not fish, man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, dude. Is this like the house yes, theme? Yes, the house <laughs> theme. <laughs> it tastes like shit. It tastes so bad. It is weird how bad it tastes. It's like concerning. Because they're usually good. I, I This is my go-to item. I can't even think straight. There's just like taco nitrates <laughs> in my brain like syphilis bacteria. I don't know how to process the fact that this is so gross when it's I've eaten probably like 200 of these in my lifetime. It means that you rely on this being fresh and toasty. <laughs> I got Baja brain. <laughs> We are in the we're, we're fucking final stretch. And we're in the final stretch. We do not have that many dishes left. We got boxes. What the fuck is going on here? I think this is a frittata. It's a Mexican pizza. It's pizza. It's pizza. How can I fuck that up? I'm so exhausted in in all the ways that this is a just a taco they be. haven't folded. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. It's just an unfolded taco that takes up more room. That's crazy. Custom taco. It's so cold. It is so cold. It's like colder than room temperature. This How did that happen? Authentic Mexican food is just an unfolded taco. What makes a Mexican pizza? Is like it looks like a quesadilla with just stuff on top now. An explosion of flavor in your mouth. It is. <laughs> it's more like an assault of flavor, like an attack. <laughs> they made this monstrosity that it's they call pizza as marketing. And to call it Mexican pizza, I feel like they found like this one Mexican spice and they threw it in there. Who's the CEO of Taco Bell? If he's a white guy, all of this is fucked up. Mark King? All right. I don't want to jump to conclusions. Who am I? He could perhaps not be white. What the? There's more? What is this? This is the nacho, like loaded nacho supreme or something or other. Dude. Oh, man. <laughs> All right. We might have waited a little too long. Nachos don't, don't normally do this. It's. Oh. I hate it. Oh. It's really bad. Oh. I think this we need a utensil here. Like a vegetarian power bowl. <laughs> Cheers. Amen to our health. Yeah. How's that going for you? It sucks. Yeah. It just sucks. All right. Here's our last item. It's potato. What an item. Who gets this, man? I don't know. It's just a side. And this I is just it. a weird get. Try it. It's not bad. It's not bad. I, it's kind of a vibe. All right. It is time. It's the final course, Slime. The desserts. We got the cinnamon twists and then the cinnamon little munchkin. Uh, these, these are baller. All right, here it is. Here's the last thing. He just had 40 items from Taco Bell. This is the final one. I feel like shit to us, but I'm glad that we went through this journey together. And I just have to say that I wouldn't want to have done it with anyone except for you, man. Through good times and through bad, through taco or burrito. Through Sometimes it's not about. Shut the fuck up. You know, you Sometimes it's not it? about. You want to redo it for the video? The food for the you VOD? eat. Shake. But it's about. Edit this. Fuck. The, can you just eat the. Oh. That's really That's good. That's delicious. That is delicious. It's almost like it erased everything else. It's like they fucked everything up, kind of. Yeah. Except that. They didn't fuck up the dessert. At the end of the 40 plus items we just ate, first of all, how do you feel? I feel like uh, like a fish stuffed with like dry grass. It's something unnatural has been put inside me at large. I feel like I have, uh, I have taste aversion to food. <laughs> the one thing you want to avoid at Taco Bell is gotta be the, uh, what was the goopy shit that we had? The It was the beef quesarito. That was like, Shitty poop poop ass butt goofy. <laughs> it was bad. I would avoid burritos. I would just steer clear. A oh, best item. If you had to go to Taco Bell, gun to your head, and you had to get the Queen of England one item so that she would say, you will live. This is a weird scenario you're in. Yeah. The queen's um, being such an asshole. She's being, she's being a real dick. Uh, 
I would bring her, I would bequeath a Pontihern and her Corgos. Probably a hot, fresh, cheesy gordita crunch. It's the best item on the menu. Yeah. Out of the bag, it is just, it's everything you need and a little bit more. And I think that's important. Yeah. There it is, boys. If you go to Taco Bell, get the cheesy gordita crunch. <laughs> And don't get all the things. <laughs> don't get all the things and then eat a bite of all of them. Oh, Just man. Just get one or two things and finish them. Way better. Anyway, tune in next time where we do McDonald's versus Burger King, eating everything from both at the same time. Don't miss it. It's going to happen. It's not happening. It's happening. It's just actually not.